So, parents of teenagers, have you ever had a moment where you almost asked your teenager a question, but then you didn't? Maybe you didn't ask because, one, you were pretty sure they weren't going to answer anyway, two, you didn't want to deal with the emotional fallout of the conversation, or three, you were kind of afraid to hear the answer. I get it. Communicating or trying to communicate with a teenager is hard work sometimes. But here's the thing. As the most important influence in your teenager's life, it's your job to be the person who knows your kid the most. Sure, that sounds like the most challenging thing ever, especially when talking to your teenager. It feels like talking to either an inanimate object or an erupting volcano sometimes. But keep trying. Get involved in their lives in the same way you get involved in your friends' lives or the lives of the people you watch on TV. Learn more about them. Become a student of your teenager. When you're with them, ask open-ended questions about their feelings, their friends, their interests, something you just watched on TV together, or their thoughts on what's happening in the world. Then, and this is a big deal, listen, process, understand. Don't try to make their communication time a moment to lecture them. Because truth be told, you have absolutely no idea when they'll be this vulnerable again. Teenagers are very delicate in this way. But the more they feel heard by you, the more likely they'll be to open up to you in the future, even without your prompting. So here's a tip. Go learn something new about your teenager, today. You can do that by asking great questions and then choosing to listen. Remember that your teenager is changing quickly. So don't assume what you knew about them last year is still true today. Get to know them now.